Now grab hold of us. Oh, no! Oh, oh, never mind me. Just take this somewhere safe. We mustn't let anything happen to the flower. Oh, no! Hit subscribe and click the like icon. You can do this, Pello. Just a little more. Whoa! Phew. Got it. Now to get down from here. Hmm. You know, Pico, some of these vines look and feel kind of funny. See? This one almost looks like a... <gasps> snake! And the big one, too! I've got to get down! Ranger Leo speaking! Huh? Pico, is that you? Where's Peo? What's going on, Leo? I'm not sure, Katie. It's Pico! Pico? Wait, do you hear that? It sounds like somebody's talking. Huh? Something's not right. Send me the video, Leo. I'll see if I can isolate the voice and amplify its volume. Sure thing, Katie. And... Done! Pico, tell them that I'm stuck in a tree. And there's a big green snake right in front of me. I can't get down. Uh-oh. If we zoom in and unblur it... <gasps> Peo! Green snake. Hmm, they're not that big. Can we look at the video again? Some of the vines look a little funny. Just have to do a quick scan. <gasps> a green anaconda? Oh no! Peo is stuck in a tree with an anaconda. We've got to get him down quick. We can find out more information about the animal on the way there. Let's see. The green anaconda is the world's largest snake. Anacondas are constrictors. They coil themselves around their prey and squeeze them. With their stretchy jaws, anacondas open their mouths wide to swallow their prey whole. Once they've eaten a big meal, they can go for weeks or months without food. Oh boy, we'd better hurry. Look, it's Peo's bag. Pico! Where's Peo? Is he okay? Over here! I'm over here! Whoa! It's huge! Yeep. Don't worry, Peo. We'll get you down. Jetpack, Jetpack activate. activate! Here you go, Peo. Thanks, Leo. Now grab hold of us. Oh, no! Oh, oh. Never mind me. Just take this somewhere safe. We mustn't let anything happen to the flower. <gasps> oh, no! Don't worry, Peo. I'll get it. And I'll find a way to get you down. We leave no rangers behind. Huh? Oh! Well, that was easy. Where's it going? Oh, no! Guys! No! Not the bug! Now we'll never get the flower back! Hang on, Peo. Let's get you down first. Huh? Pico! No! You'll get hurt! <laughs> no, hero! Hero! The anaconda's way too strong for them. Katie, help me grab its tail. Stop right there. Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! Back away from the tail. What you're about to do is very dangerous. Tangling with an anaconda is a dangerous thing to do. Anacondas are big and strong, but they usually only attack humans when they feel threatened. If you mess around with its tail, it might see that as a threat. Green anacondas may move slowly on land, but they're great in water. They're fast swimmers, and because their eyes and nostrils are on the top of their heads, they can breathe and see even when most of their body is underwater. What do we do then, Ranger Rocky? We have to get my bag. No worries, Peo. I'll take it from here. Leave this to the experts, children. <laughs> What's he going to do? I have no idea, 
But I'm sure Ranger Rocky has an awesome plan. Now, now. I don't want any trouble, but I'm going to need that bag. Oh, no, you don't. Calm down now. <gasps> Ranger Rocky! <laughs> oh, it's clogging him. Now, it's constricting him. Are you sure you don't need us to do anything, Ranger Rocky? <clears throat> nope. I have it all under control. Aha! Catch! My bag! Phew, it's all right. It's getting kind of squeezy. Time to get out of here. Be back in a second, Junior Rangers. Oh! Ranger Rocky! Oh, no! Ranger Rocky! Ah! Ah! Ranger Rocky, you're okay. I sure am. That was amazing. But weren't you scared of the anaconda, Ranger Rocky? It's huge! There was no need to be scared. Anacondas are not out to hurt people. The anaconda was just defending itself. Ranger Rocky is right. We're the ones who entered its home. Well, I've learned my lesson. Never approach or provoke an anaconda when you see one. Always check a tree before you climb it. You never know what's living in there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hi, Junior Ranger Kai. Are you ready for movie night? Hi, Leo. I don't think I can make it. What? Why not? I have to collect the smell of a binturong for my smell collection. A binturong? What's that? Binturongs are animals that smell like popcorn. I need to collect its smell. <sighs> but I'm just so busy. There's no way I'm gonna make it for the movie night. What if we help you find the binturong, Kai? Would that save you some time? You would do that for me? Of course! That's what Junior Rangers are for! That would be awesome! Call me when you guys find one! Ranger out! Ranger out! An animal that smells like popcorn? I've never heard of that! How exactly does a binturong look like? Let's find out! A binturong has a face like a cat, a body like a small bear, and a tail like a monkey. They're also known as bear cats, but they're not actually bears or cats. Binturongs smell like popcorn because of their urine. They use their smell to mark their territories and attract mates. Where can we find binturongs? They can be found in the forests of Southeast Asia. Then we should get Farah to help us. She's familiar with the forest there. Great idea, Leo. Let's call her on the way there. All right. Do you smell that? Popcorn. Popcorn. <laughs> it's coming from over there. <gasps> A binturong. <laughs> Good job, hero. I'll send Kai our location. Huh? Hero, play nice. That's strange. My handbook says binturongs live high up in the trees and are really good climbers. Oh no! Are you okay, binturong? <sighs> it's not a very good climber. Is your handbook incorrect, Farah? <gasps> My handbook is never wrong! I think Popcorn just hasn't learned how to climb a tree. Popcorn? Popcorn, popcorn is a nice name for it. He smells like popcorn. Popcorn the Binturong. I love it. While we wait for Kai to get here, we should teach Popcorn how to climb. Here, Popcorn. Just grip the branch really tightly, then pull yourself up. Easy. That's it. You're nearly there. Good job, Popcorn. Let's try another one. Huh? Popcorn, you're never going to learn if you stop at the first branch. I think Popcorn needs a little motivation to climb higher. That's right, Popcorn. I have your favorite fig right here. Come get it. You're doing great, Popcorn. You can do this. We believe in you. 
Aww. Let's take a little break. Here, Popcorn, you deserve this. <gasps> gotcha! Ranger Rocky! Phew! Thank you, Ranger Rocky! You're welcome, Leo! Are you guys teaching the Binturong to climb? Yep. Popcorn here doesn't climb very well, Ranger Rocky. Well, the secret is in Popcorn's tail. The Binturong has a prehensile tail. That means that it can use its tail to grab objects. Their tail acts like a fifth limb that holds onto branches and trunks, allowing the Binturong to climb more easily. This makes it one of their more important climbing tools. There is also a leathery patch at the tip of its tail that helps them grip branches more securely. We'll make sure Popcorn practices more. Great! I'll leave you to it. Good luck, Junior Rangers. Bye, Bye Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. Oh dear, be careful, Popcorn. Hmm, I don't think its tail is strong enough. Then let's fix that. I know how we can make Popcorn stronger. Lift. Just a bit more. That's it. Come on, higher. You got this! Think of all the trees you can climb after this! That's the way, Popcorn! You're doing great! You're nearly at the top! Just a bit more! Alright! You made it, Popcorn! Awesome! Yay! I told you Binturongs could climb! My handbook is never wrong. Oops. Sure, Farah. Hi, guys. Hi, Kai. Hi, Kai. Hi. Thanks for finding the Binturong. I can't wait to collect its smell. Hi, Popcorn. Don't mind me. I'm just here to collect your smell. Got it. Thanks, Popcorn. Oh, it's time for movie night. Let's go. Bye, Popcorn. Yay, movie night. Bye, Popcorn. Bye, popcorn. <gasps> Wait for me. Mission accomplished. See you on the other side, Zumi. It is on! Ooh. What was that? Those are not rocks. They are hippos. But why are there so many of them here? Maybe Leo can solve this mystery. Oh, hi Junior Ranger Jane. What's up? Hello Leo. Something strange is happening. A small mud hole is swamped with hippos. Have a look at this photo. Hmm, that is strange. But don't worry, Jane. We'll figure it out when we get there. Here it is, the hippopotamus. Hippopotamus, or hippos, tend to live in large groups with as many as 200 hippos. Hippos are semi-aquatic mammals. That means they live both on land and in water. But hippos spend most of their time in rivers, lakes, and mud holes to stay cool. In fact, hippos can close their nostrils and hold their breath underwater for as long as five minutes. So, the hippos want to stay cool. But why do they choose such a small mud hole? I'm not sure, Katie. We'll just have to head there to find out why. Whoa! Hi, Jane. Hi, Leo. Hi, Katie. Poor hippos. They're squashed like sardines. We should help them find a bigger place to stay cool. A lake? Let's see. A lake. Found one! There's a huge lake just over that hill! Do you see the lake, Jane? You are not going to believe this. Huh? Where's the lake? Look! It's... Ranger, Ranger Rocky! Rocky.
Rocky. What are you doing, Ranger Rocky? A rain dance to summon rain. The weather has been a lot warmer this year, and it hasn't been raining much. Would the rain dance work, Ranger Rocky? The hippos are in need of water. I can only hope it would. But what's this about the hippos? They're all squashed up in a small mud puddle. Do you know more about them? I sure do. Hippos might look friendly, but they're dangerous animals. They're super strong and have a mighty bite. The mud puddle is simply too small. We have to find them a new home. I know of a huge river that hasn't dried up. Perfect. We can herd the hippos there. How do you plan to do that, Leo? Hmm. What do hippos eat? Hippos love to eat plants like grasses, small shoots, and reeds. I've got it. I know how we can herd them. All right. Hang tight, Rangers. River, here we come. <laughs> We're here! Enjoy! Huh? What's wrong, little guy? It is Mother Hippo. We need to bring her baby back to her. Let's go, Rangers. Platypus One, activate! Hang on, everyone. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. Don't worry, little buddy. We'll get you to your mama. It will be okay. Excuse me! Coming through! Gotta get a baby hippo back to its mom! Whoa! <laughs> Hang on, guys! I got you! Uh oh! Stop! Don't fight! Break it up! It was just an accident! <gasps> oh no! We are sinking! What do we do now? Activate flight mode! The wings will keep us afloat! Got it! Platypus One, activate! Leave it to me, Junior Rangers. <gasps> Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! Pardon me. Sorry. Pardon me. Go to Mama. Yay! Now let's get out of here. I love a happy ending. Accomplished. Hit subscribe and click the like icon.